The Holy Cross men's ice hockey team just concluded its most successful Atlantic hockey regular season in 10 years. The Crusaders tied for second and are the third seed in the Atlantic Hockey Tournament and will host a quarterfinal series March 11th through the 13th in the Hart Center. Head coach David Berard and senior captain Matt Vidal feel that the success of the team is due to their willingness to get better every day. I think there are a lot of factors that have led to our team's success this year. I think one of them is coming back early in August, getting to know each other, getting to assimilate the freshmen into our, our team and our culture. And I think the other big thing is our team chemistry. We're a very, very close group. Um, we're all best of friends and we all want to fight for each other on the ice and I think that goes a long way. Um, also, Coach Berard being here for his second year, um, you know, all of us are familiar with his systems now, we're familiar with how he wants us to play and um, his culture in and of itself, so I think all of those factors have played into our team's success this year. Well, we've put in a lot of work, um, you know, as players, as coaches, as staff to just continue to get better. We, we talk a lot about player development. Our guys have put in a lot of hours uh, outside of practice, whether it's watching video, whether it's doing individual skill work at improving their game. And as their individual games have improved, so has and our team game has improved. And we put a lot of time and effort into being a better team, into playing fast, into being tough to play against offensively and defensively. And we've just built confidence steadily throughout the course of the year. And if you look at a lot of the stats um, at the end of the regular season, they're all reflective of that improvement. So it's been a, a really good regular season. I think our identity as a hockey team has been cemented through the 34 games that we've played. And we have a lot of confidence in how we play and how it leads to success. The Crusaders' 2.11 goals allowed per game in league contests lead the conference and are the best the team has done in the 13 years of Atlantic hockey. Last year, the team averaged 2.3 goals per game, but this year they are averaging 3.18 goals per game. Last year, we, um, you know, we set the school record for team defense, and um, you know, it was great. It was great for for that to happen. And going into the year, I remember at our first team meeting, we talked about wanting to be even better than we were. Uh, identifying that playing great team defense is an integral part of winning a championship at the end of the year. Well, we knew we knew team defense was going to be our bread and butter as a as a team. That in order for us to win, we have to be good defensively. But we also identified after last year that we need to score more goals. And you know, this year we've almost scored uh, one more goal per game, which is great. And our defensive numbers have come down. Vidal and Brad know that the experience of the seniors and the continued hard work of the team will lead to success during the playoffs. Yeah, as a senior class, unfortunately, we haven't had the opportunity to play in the Final Four in Rochester, so I know that's been a goal of ours ever since we came in as freshmen, and you know, not achieving that um, up until this year, we've really strived to, to try and get there, and I think as freshmen, um, having the opportunity to get a first round by and losing to Mercyhurst at home, that was really, really heartbreaking. And then the following year, um, we had success in the first round beating RIT, but then losing to Mercyhurst again in the quarterfinal on the road. And then our junior year, it was unfortunate we lost in the first round in Niagara. So there's been a lot of defeat, and I think that we've learned from all of those defeats. And it's used us as motivation to uh, try and get back to Rochester and winning a championship. Everything's an elimination now. You know, we get the best of three series, and if we're fortunate enough to advance out of that, then it's all single game. You either win or you go home. So, um, you know, the, the regular season was a, was a long test, and now it's uh, on us to make sure that we execute um, what we learned over the course of the year, bring it into the playoffs, and hopefully lead us to a championship. To be a part of the team's drive for the championship, be sure to attend the quarterfinal series in the Hart Center. For tickets to the games, call 1-844-GO-CROSS or visit GoHolyCross.com slash tickets. Reporting for GoHolyCross.com, I'm Katherine Rutter.